Hi, my name is Katie Galanka, and I'm from Columbus, Ohio. I live here with my roommate, my fiance, and my three beautiful cats in a house we just bought last summer. I've been doing makeup since middle school. Um, I started because I used to be really afraid of fake gore, and I wouldn't watch any horror movies, and <laughs> they would be nightmares. And I hated them. And eventually my parents took me to a play called Tecumseh. It's an outdoor show. And there's a lot of realistic gore in it. And it's on the program. And I was like so afraid to go. <laughs> so my parents took me on a backsta backstage tour. And they showed me about blood packs. And um, fake wounds and stuff. And I've been obsessed with making <laughs> fake wounds ever since. I, yeah. <laughs> This is milk. This is gravy. <laughs> this. And sandwich is probably in the wall somewhere. The, right. So the project I'm working on today is a kind of demon monster I've been developing for a while. I've made this monster one time before with silicone, or sorry, with latex, and then this time I'm going to make it with a partial silicone, silicone appliance. So today I'm going to be making an appliance that looks like a demon monster, which is a concept I've been working on for a while now.
So I did special effects all through high school. I made short films and did photo shoots with my friends and all sorts of things like that. And then after school, I went to Indiana University to study acting. And I graduated from there two and a half years ago with an acting degree. My last year of school, I studied abroad in Moscow, studied acting in Russia, which was really amazing. And then when I came back, I finished school and got my degree. It ended up moving back here to Columbus, Ohio to be near my family. And I was immediately offered this amazing special effects job at Scare Factory, where <laughs> <laughs> at Scare Factory, we make animatronic props, mostly horror-themed things, obviously. Um, mostly my job is to paint zombie faces and assemble uh, animatronic German shepherds. In my spare time, I still freelance special effects to various doing photo shoots and short films, but I've been dedicating most of my time lately to working in the animatronic shop. I am looking to expand my practical effects career because that's actually what I really love to do. But working at Scare Factory was such a good opportunity for me and it's allowed me eight hours a day every work day of the week to practice my technical skills. So I've gotten much better as a painter over the last couple of years. So I'm really grateful for that job. So this is my little makeshift studio here. Got my sculpting tools, a little bit of latex, my rubbing alcohol and water, silicone mixture, thickener, dye. And then I got my other like my fake blood, my sealer, my applying my applying tools, all sorts of stuff like that. Mm, a little spray bottle to make washes, some latex gloves when I'm not using silicone. <laughs> yeah, and then inside of here I have a few more sculpting tools, some chip brushes, a knife that's probably dangerous, um, cheesecloth, some more application tools. Yeah. Oh look, some fake fingers. I made it work just because they're funny. Um, and this is a cute little stencil I made of some elephants making a heart with their, their trunks. And sandwich is probably in the wall somewhere. <laughs>